All right, guys, it's me, Swoop. I'm still here with Mr. 540, and we're talking about the different types of passes, okay? The next pass we're gonna talk about is the overhead pass, all right? Now, no, 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 not overhead like this. This pass is used for long distances, okay? Sometimes you get a big rebound down there in the paint. You wanna make sure you keep the ball over your head. Hence the name overhead pass, all right? Same fundamentals we talked about before. We wanna step and we wanna take the ball over our head, passing it to the chest area. Now, as you notice, Mr. 540 is pretty close, okay? If we back him out of the shot a little bit, we head on down, step, I can still execute the pass at longer ranges. No matter how far Mr. 540 goes, go Mr. 540, go! Still executing a long distance pass. This overhead pass is used in many different occasions, but the number one time it's used is to start a fast break after a huge rebound, or maybe when you're taking the ball out of bounds and you wanna throw a long distance pass to uh, pass the ball to your teammate so they can score a basket. And that is how you execute the overhead pass.